Belgrave Square, in the smart heart of London's West End. A good address for rich people. Rich people with jewels worth a fortune. It was an open invitation for desperate men like Bain and Karen. But was it worth the heart-stopping fear of those dangerous moments? Money you want. Half of it belongs to me. You don't tell me where you're meeting him, or I'll... Well, what do you do? Call the police? Go ahead. Call them. Oh, yes, I knew about you. Well, I knew about you. I could smell you a mile off. And you'd better get out of here, Ozzy, because... Malaga! The story of a daring jewel robbery and its aftermath of violence and deception. In turn, Ray, the fool's way. And you're not a fool, you know. I've known men like you. You shouldn't have a criminal record. I want to arrest you for the murder before you commit it. Don't do it. The manhunt was on. Madrid. Malaga. A manhunt that had its moments of peace and beauty. Its moments of gaiety and abandon. Trevor Howard is vain, double-crossed, and disillusioned. If anything does happen, destroy my passport. I'm Mr. Nobody, sunk without a trace, no relatives. Now I've got six hours to wait. Please leave me alone. The Tom and Jones and the Porgy and Bess girl, Dorothy Dandridge and Gianna. The kind who takes a man's eye, and Karen was one of them. <laughs> you mean to tell me that's how you really feel about that cheap little gutter snipe? Why, Tony, she's just a trollop. Edmund Purdon is the thieving, lying Karen. I give you 24 hours. 24 hours? I came here to get my money or to kill you. Execution is postponed 24 hours. 